Hi everyone, my name is Felix. I'm a senior at Clemens High School. My name is Nishant Aranke. I'm a sophomore at Clemens High School. Hi, my name is Yash Desai. I'm a sophomore here at Clemens High School. Hi, my name is Samyukta Singh. My name is Alex Mao. We go to Clemens High School. We participate in public forum debate. Hi, my name is Jefferson Wren. I am a junior at Clemens High School, and this is my third year being part of the Clemens Academic Speech Team. So I joined debate because, first of all, my friends were there and also I got to learn a lot about the world uh, through debate, so I decided to join it. So during 8th grade year in middle school, I heard about debate being one of uh, an amazing activity mainly because of the awards you received. I joined it because I wanted to get a, a better understanding of debate and just become a better debater overall. Our goal for this year is first of all to qualify for TFA State and then hopefully break and win. This year my goals are, you know, I would like to qualify for TFA State both in debate and extemp. Hopefully get somewhere with that in the state tournament and maybe if I'm lucky I'll also get to go to nationals. So I have quite a few goals for this year, some of which probably will not happen. But um, I mean this year I'd like to win the state tournament and kind of stop uh, this other school from winning three times in a row. I'd also like to have some national success, some of which I've already gotten, some of which I have not, so. So I started out debate in ninth grade, and I was like a little bit above average. I tested the waters doing both LD, PF, and oratory, but it wasn't until 10th grade year that I really found my calling, which was FX or foreign extemporaneous speaking. He's our key ally in the region, so if Saudi Arabia is seen as inherently bad, it's also gonna shed a bad light on the United States. So when looking at today's topic, we're gonna answer it in three questions. So how FX basically works is that you have 30 minutes to prepare a 7 minute speech that is related to like US foreign policy or just current events going on around the world. But last year, I like struggled really hard with my first year and I was like about to make it to state but the last tournament, instead of getting 5th place which would have assured me like going to state, I got 6th place so I only got 11 out of 12 state points required. And it was like very, very depressing. I cried for like 5 minutes and my teammates consoled me. But I feel like this year, I'm gonna like turn it around. I've been working a lot and really hard, and I feel that this year is gonna be my state call year. My debate story actually started out quite rough. So I discovered that I quite couldn't put my argumental arguments and train of logic together properly. We can really see these Abe economics grow in because with these, what's these nations are economic competitive in the face of super house and superpowers such as China, Furthermore, I also struggled to enunciate my words properly because I wasn't used to public speaking or any other st style of speaking. I think my biggest struggle with debate is probably just trying to manage my schoolwork along with my debate preparation. Obviously, going to a tournament takes preparation, so it's really important to prepare but at the same time to keep our grades up. Me and Sammy work pretty well together as a team. We have our ups and our downs, but you know, at the end of the day, it all balances out because we're all responsible for our work and we come to tournament ready to win. From the end of my freshman year to the beginning of my sophomore year, I improved gradually over the summer as well by attending a series of debate camps and by reading a series of articles on, uh, on argumentation as well as speaking styles. So this year I feel like I have a pretty good chance of making state. Like last year by the end of the year I was already getting pretty good at foreign extemporaneous speaking. So then um, over the summer I've been like listening to a lot of prominent people speak. I've been uh, reading books that are related to politics and I've been just like doing a lot more work than I have last year. And uh, after previewing a lot of people give speeches like in our local tournaments, I feel like I'm just more prepared and like more ready to like qualify for state this year. As I proceeded through the year, I discovered that debate wasn't necessarily about earning the, your qualifications or earning the best rewards possible, but it was more of improving your speaking skills and argument development abilities. Clement's academic speech team is a close-knit community where I've made my friends and have been able to progress as a debater. As time went by, it wasn't just giving speeches and getting oral critiques from my friends and from my teammates. It was about being with my friends and being in a community where I could grow as a speaker and engage in critical thinking. So debate has helped me a lot in my academic career. Namely, it's probably helped me within the writing portions of my classes. So in history classes, in English classes, in classes that take more than just numbers, I've been able to excel in writing and I've been able to improve my writing skills so that I become a good writer. Debate as an activity has gotten me 
the skills necessary to kind of criticize a lot of the implicit assumptions that I had coming into high school. And it's really made me a better thinker, and it's made the world a lot more interesting. And so teaching other kids to kind of think critically and to probe their intuitions and their assumptions is also something that's really enjoyable for me. I want not to only make my own arguments in my own cases, I want to collaborate with my friends and my teammates to make better arguments and better cases to run a tournament. And because of this, I can safely and soundly say that it's not only me who is qualified to TFA State, but my friends and teammates as well. Although I didn't exactly achieve my dream of becoming a state champion, I am now a junior and I am absolutely intent on making my mark at the state debate tournament this year. And it really shows that you know hard work does pay off and it just takes patience. I'm feeling very proud to be a part of Clement's academic speech and debate team. And I'm just being, uh, I feel very proud to be a part of the debate community in general. It's a great day.